I was trying to isolate myself out of the circuit, frankly, is basically what I was doing. So <clears throat> I flipped the wand around so that one side only, the left side is touching the wood, right? Uh, the any 2 bulb is in there. I already see because it's on its side. Let's see. There. Uh, but that strip on the other side comes over and it's got a gap. gap there, uh, no direct grounding on the thing, this is it. Right, so I wasn't actually adding anything to the circuit to when I moved the chair over here. Or I moved this over actually, just do that. Make it make contact, right, physical contact. Still gap there. So you turn it on again. Right. Really tiny gap seems to make it a little bit brighter. But that's as bright as it was when I was in the circuit. Half on the wood, and half on the ground. So what it means. What it means is I need a ground. I need to bring a ground and bring it into local relation here. And that will be where the current is drawn up, made salient. Because uh, I tried, I tried with something like this, right? I tried a little capacitor. It's got a diode on one side to try and block in the negative charge. So it's only letting negative into this side of the cap. The other side was short and I just sat it up here like this. Move this thing around, try and get it within a certain distance, and then I'd move the bottom floater around over here and get that close over here. And I got it to where it was directly arcing from the top of this coil up to the negative there, and a direct arc from the positive here to the positive there. And I let it run for 20, 30 seconds, and it accumulated maybe two or three volts. <laughs> so yeah, really, there's no current actually there. It's all volts, and the volts isn't really being able to affect the current, evidently. So, I mean, it might need like an arbitrary inductance or something like that, but the ground in this case is a well of current, and that well of current will be directed by voltage in some measure anyway, huh? So, that seems to be what the actual deal is. So, it's nice that it lights up. I guess I will need to make uh, make like the chair, the collector, and just put a couple diodes, like an Abramenko plug on the chair, touching the chair, and then off into a capacitor that's just sitting on the wood part of the chair, insulated. Maybe see if that makes it work, or what happens then. Mm, stuff to try. <laughs>